language models have captured the world's imagination, changing how we think about the future of computing. With Palm 2, Bard's math, logic, and reasoning skills made a huge leap forward for tasks like code generation, debugging, and explaining code snippets. Bard has already learned more than 20 programming languages. We've also heard that you want dark theme, so starting today, you can activate it. <laughs> People often ask Bard for a head start drafting emails and documents. So today, we are launching two more export actions, making it easy to move Bard's responses right into Gmail and Docs. <laughs> I'm excited to announce that tools are coming to BARD. <laughs> and in the coming months, we're bringing in the powers of Lens to BARD. So. <laughs> so if you're looking to have some fun with your fur babies, you might upload an image and ask BARD to write a funny caption about these two. A lens detects that this is a photo of a goofy German Shepherd and a Golden Retriever. Bard uses that to create some funny captions. If you ask me, I think they're both good boys. Okay, now let's do another one. Imagine I'm 18 and I need to apply to college. I won't date myself with how long it's been, but it's still an overwhelming process. So, I'm thinking about colleges, but I'm not sure what I want to focus on. I'm into video games, and what kinds of programs might be interesting? Okay, this is a helpful head start. Hmm, animation looks pretty interesting. Now I could ask, help me find colleges with animation programs in Pennsylvania. Okay, great, that's a good list of schools. Now to see where these are, I might now say, show these on a map. Here Bard's gonna use Google Maps to visualize where the schools are. Now that's a taste of what's possible when Bard meets some of Google's apps, but that's just the start. Bard will be able to tap into all kinds of services from across the web with extensions from incredible partners like Instacart, Indeed, Khan Academy, and many more. So today, we are removing the waitlist and opening up BARD to over 180 countries and territories. It's amazing to see the rate of progress so far. More advanced models, so many new capabilities and the ability for even more people to collaborate with BARD. And when we're ready to move BARD to our Gemini model, I'm really excited about more advancements to come. So that's where we're going with BARD, connecting tools from Google and amazing services across the web to help you do and create anything you can imagine through a fluid collaboration with our most capable large language models. There's so much to share in the days ahead.